Hey guys, it's Ricardo and welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. As you can see here, we're in um, safe mode. So as you see here, it indicates that safe mode is turned on. You can see it up there in the notification area. It's always also down here that says safe mode. Now, um, this tutorial is for those who are stuck in this mode and cannot exit on any Samsung or other Android device. Now, this is the Samsung Galaxy S8. So let me just go ahead and unlock. Okay, so as you can see here, guys, once in safe mode, which is a special utility mode, third-party applications have been um, disabled. So as seen here, these um, blocked out apps are actually disabled since we are in um, safe mode. All right, so only the original apps that came on the device will work. You're seen here, and of course, another indication here in safe mode is that some apps that are um, not compatible with this mode will be um, grayed out. All right, and widgets will not um, work. All right, so let's go straight into the fix. Now, in order to fix this issue, what you want to do, guys, is um, to exit this mode if you're stuck. Is number one, you're gonna um, slide down the notifications um, tray, as you're seeing here, and it says that safe mode is turned on. Tap here to turn off safe mode. So if I go ahead and tap, of course, it will give me the option to actually restart, and I can actually go ahead and restart now, and I'll be out of the mode. Or I could actually go ahead and just long press the power button. And of course, if I long press the power button, I can go ahead again and simply hit power off. And of course, if I tap this again, I'll power off and it should come out of safe mode. So that's the first thing you want to actually try on your device, which might be slightly different. All right. So go ahead and try that. All right. If that didn't work, guys, if your device has a removable battery, mine does not. But you actually get the idea. What you can do is to go ahead, simply um, remove the back of your device, remove the battery, also remove the SIM card. Once you remove the SIM card, leave it out for about two to three minutes. And once you leave it out for two to three minutes, what you're gonna do is gonna put back everything together and power up, and it should actually boot or boot up normally in normal um, mode. All right. If that didn't work, guys, the next option you can actually try is you're gonna go through, and of course you can go into um, settings. Then you're going to go into apps and what you're going to do guys is you're going to find which apps you actually install um, last and of course let's say for example it was um, something like um, let's say Adobe Acrobat you can actually go in you can actually uninstall that app so any app that you install recently before you actually started out those um, this problem you can go ahead and also uninstall it and that should fix it um, if you do not want to uninstall apps what you can try before the uninstall process is to go back again find some apps that you recently um, installed go through go to storage and once you're in storage you're going to clear cache and then you're going to clear data all right don't worry it will not delete anything permanently it's just going to um, delete the temporary files that's on this all right also if you don't want to do it this way or this way is not working another way you can clear the cache is to actually boot into um, recovery and actually clear the cache partition of the entire device i'll show you to do that with a link on screen and of course at the end of the video we'll show you how to clear the cache partition as well since it's a totally different um, process you can actually try that but if all this fails guys just go ahead and um, uninstall the recently installed apps and then try to reboot all right another thing you can also try guys is to reset app preferences you're gonna go to settings again go to um, apps you're gonna tap the three dots in the upper left once you trap, um, <laughs> click those three dots, you're going to go ahead and uh, reset um, app preferences. So let's go ahead and hit reset. I don't want to reset mine right now. So once you reset app preferences, that should, too should actually help out. So you can go ahead and do that. All right. Another thing you can actually try, guys, is that on some devices, to actually get into safe mode, you would actually go into the power menu on some devices and long press this um, button here. And actually you'll get into safe mode on other devices which might be your case you'll actually have to turn off the phone and as soon as the phone is booting you actually hold down both volume um, up and down at the same time and of course it will boot into safe mode if yours is a device that actually uses the button combination which may be volume up and down simply reverse the process by actually pressing volume up and down while the phone is booting and sometimes this will force the device out of um, safe mode if you're actually um, stuck and of course guys another warning is that your buttons might be stuck such as the volume button or volume keys what you can actually do is try to nudge and try to clean the button um, if you can you can open up and clean um, the sensor or the area beneath here to actually get rid of dirt or grime that might be causing the button to to be um, stuck so stop buttons can also be the reason why you're getting into um, 
safe mode and you'll need to actually repair or actually get the dirt from out of this section to actually get the sensor to start working again so you can actually boot as normal all right so guys if that didn't work or all of those tips did not work what you're gonna do guys is you can actually try to do a full um, reset i also have a tutorial on how to reset your um, device i'm gonna put it on screen somewhere around here or i'll put it at the end of the video somewhere in either side of the video so guys this is from block tech tips showing you how to actually exit safe mode in case you're stuck so this is saying bye until next time guys bye